Hello, welcome back to my channel, Sinis Primary Math. I am feeling really humble. There are incredible people like you who have subscribed to my YouTube channel. Your inspiring comments and support has motivated me to bring out more videos on primary math topics. In this video, I shall highlight some difficulties faced by primary school children in identifying open and closed figures. The basic concepts in geometry are not grasped by children easily if we practice conventional teaching methods only. Here is a quiz for you. Look at the plane figure. Is the figure open or close? A bit confusing? Many children are not sure whether a figure like this is open or close. They conclude that a certain part of it is close though it doesn't look like a close figure. Don't worry, I assure you by the end of this video, you will be able to identify open or close figures easily without any confusion. I have also prepared a worksheet for you all. Geometry skills are essential for children to make progress in other branches of mathematics and hence it is important to have a clear understanding of the basic concepts. In geometry, a closed figure can be defined as an enclosed figure whose line segments or curves are connected or they meet. An open figure can be defined as a figure whose line segments or curves do not meet. Simply defining open and closed figure and evaluating children's understanding is not enough. Children should be able to use the concept in different contexts as well. Hence, they should be given enough opportunities to build an understanding of the concepts through familiar activity methods. Allow children to play with concrete objects, for example, provide colored straws, mastics, straight or flexible wire pieces, etc. Ask them to make different open and closed figures using straws or mastics for line segments and wires for curves. At the initial stage, let children to get a feel for the concept of a closed figure with straight edges. Then introduce the figures of triangle, quadrilateral, pentagon, hexagon, etc. without stating their geometrical terms. Look at these figures. Both figures have the same number of mastics or sides. But figure 1 is a close while figure 2 is open. Start at any point on the boundary of this figure. Trace it with a pencil. At the end, you reach the same point that you started from. Figure that start and end at the same point and that have no open ends are called closed figures. It has an inside and an outside called interior and exterior of the figure. Start at point A and trace the figure with your finger. The figure ends at point B, a different point altogether. Figures that start and end at different points are called open figures. Certain figures can be visually seen as open where both the start and end points are visible. When the start and end points are not easily visible, we need to trace the figure to determine whether it is open or close. Through repeat practice, children familiarize themselves with open and close figures and their basic properties. Key observations. A close figure or open figure will have straight edges or 
non straight edges or both an open figure of straight edges may have any number of edges a closed figure has an inside and outside called interior and exterior of the figure children's judgment about whether a figure is open or closed develops visual discrimination it allows them to identify and recognize the likeness and differences of figures methods to distinguish whether a figure is open or closed method 1 trace the figure starting from any position and then reaching back to the same position without any break the figure is a closed one otherwise it is an open figure method 2 if one can move from the inside of the figure to the outside or vice versa without crossing that's a break or opening exists the figure is called open otherwise it is a closed figure once this concept is clear children will become more confident and enjoy math learning okay let us go back to the unanswered entry quiz once again look at the figure apply the method we have learned trace the figure starting from one end and move forward careful no reverse move are you able to move back to the starting point yes or no no so it is an open figure hope it is clear now by the way you can take the worksheet mentioned in the beginning of the video from the description box for free subscribe the channel and click the link to download the worksheet thanks for watching if you like the video please subscribe and share it i will be back with another interesting video to clear your math concepts on a different topic till then bye